Hello, this is Borna from Borna.tv, and today I'm going to be showing you Lawn Mowing Simulator from Skyhook Games and Curve Digital. I want to thank them for sending me this early key to assess the game, check it out. Now, ever since I tried uh, Farm Simulator way back in the day, uh, I've been I've been kind of like gravitating towards cutting grass. While everyone else, while there, where everyone else was mostly plowing fields, and you know doing silage and other cool things in farm sim i was always about cutting the grass i don't know why i just i was gravitating towards that i don't know if it was a childhood thing or what but uh here we are trying it out for the very first time uh and there are some limitations with it some of these limitations include some things with uh, alt tabbing and uh I, I tend to alt tab a lot while playing games so i got to be careful not to alt tab as much as i need to and uh it's a very early build so take with take the bugs what you will and uh there's some known issues i think you uh you have to do something with q and uh and v and some other buttons to, to or, in order to, to start the lawnmower up correctly <laughs> either way we're gonna figure it out so i'm gonna i'm gonna do tutorials and uh, we're gonna get started with that because i'm definitely gonna need it company name uh, wanna cuts grass. Well, we cut grass. Got it. That was a little bit off centered there. Company logo. Uh, I think that opened a new window. Since I'm playing full screen, I can't tell. So I'm going to see if it did. It did not. I already alt tab about 10 times. <laughs> so apparently the alt tab, I just looked it up, uh, is when you pause the game. Uh, and there's some issues that happen with that. So I, I don't see, I'm clicking the plus sign here. And nothing's happening with it. So, oh, wait, they're at the bottom there. For some reason, my resolution is a little bit weird. And uh, I think it's gonna play them 34. I'm playing at 3440 by 1440. I got ultra wide, so I don't know if they're has to do with that, but we'll try to work with it. Go with him, give me a blue hat, please. Firm. Logo placement. Front and back, please. That looks like cannabis. I don't want cannabis. Hold on. Logo. Yeah, we don't want cannabis. Give me, uh, give me this instead. Yeah, that's better. Okay. What was I doing? Uniform colors. Black and blue. Now let's go with titanium white. That's too white. Okay. And white. Blick. Green. Let's go green. Convoy. Alright. Convoy. Now you have a company of your own, we need you to get your first vehicle to get cutting. Select a vehicle from the list below and take it for a test drive. Now I turned the sound down quite a bit. Because uh, the music is blasting and there's no... There's currently, I can't, well if it's there I could find it, an in-game volume mixer. So I've been using Windows volume mixer to kind of manage the audio. Okay, we'll go with, uh, oh, wait, why did, I was kind of happy with what I saw there. Let's go with the night. And then hit test drive R. Are you sure you want to test drive the night? Yes. So again, man, I am, I'm just really 
attracted to cutting grass in these games. I don't know why. Okay, here you familiarize yourself with a particular vehicle in the condition similar to a real contract. Approach the vehicle get to get on it. Use Waz to move and mouse to look around. Now, I imagine this does support controller because it is on Xbox. Um, I saw there was a lot of stuff on Xbox initially, but the PC version just became live today. If you want to go download the PC version, uh, go to Steam and you can download the demo during Steam special... Uh, their special what's it called the next festival steam next festival okay uh recover get on vehicle once you're on your vehicle you need to get a start onto the grass e vehicle is different slightly get going follow the steps at the bottom of the screen start engine hold z to start the engine there we go i like the sound use i and t to change the throttle setting i and T. Okay, so I is all the way down and T is all the way up. Got it. I assume no. Use Q to lower and raise the cutting deck. Use E and C to change the cut height. Cut height six, five, okay. Use Z to engage and disengage the cutting cutting blades. Wait, what? Okay. Okay, W accelerate and S to brake. With the vehicle started, take a moment to get used to it and drive over the grass. Start cutting. <laughs> it says press Z to engage engage the blade. There we go. Blade and gauge. Okay, the, the camera's a little bit strange. Once on the grass, you will need to get to your deck, get your deck ready by first setting the cut height and then engaging the cutting blades. You should only turn on your blades when on grass, otherwise you can damage them. Oh. When on contracts, you will be able to cut the grass at a certain height. Each contract will have its own height. Grass needs to be cut in, set the cut height. Range of five to six. While cutting on the, while cutting, you can track your progress with the bar at the top right. Uh, the progress bar shows how much you require to have muck, uh -huh, grass cut, red height, blah, blah. So five to six. I did that wrong, by the way. I should have did this. Then did this. Got ready. Hit Q. Hit Z. Cut heights need, needs to be between 5 and 6. And... I and T was throttle. What was the cut height button again? I forgot that fast. Uh... Da -da 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 uh no... Time to look it up. Where you at? Oh wait, can I adjust other things here? Okay, cut high. E and C. There we go. But while I'm in the options, let's take- Oh! Oh, that's why. I think that's why things are a little weird. Because the resolution is 2560 by 1440. And my resolution is higher than that. Hmm. Hmm. So that's why things are a little off, I think. That explains that. Alright, so engage the blade. Engage the blade. Uh, e and C. Cut height 5 and 6. Alright, here we go. Are we cutting? We're cutting. Okay, I gotta get used... I think the camera needs to be... Inverted. Invert the Y axis. That's messing with me a little bit. There's also a button for, um, I saw a button for change camera. First person. Okay, inverting the camera was a bad idea. See? <laughs> there we go. And now I need to change, sorry about this, I need to change some stuff. Uh, the mouse 
sensitivity. Let's kick that down to like 50%. Okay, I can't go below 60%. This is likely going to be my preferred view. You can see the progress is going up. Yeah, yeah. You know what? I might want to use a controller for this. We'll see. Even though I did this on on oops, I did this on farm sim with keyboard and mouse. I might try this with controller. I want those weeds count towards the progress. I guess we'll find out. So throttle, let me see how that affects things. I didn't mean to turn it off. Okay, I and T. That's what I'm doing. Okay, so that's the RPM of the blades. Oh, you got like a uh, like a taller view too. Nice. This is cool. Did I engage? Did I engage? I am a failure. <laughs> All right, we're good. Let's go back to first person. I really wish... Okay, I might have to just adjust my mouse sensitivity to be a little bit less sensitive because it feels a little bit... Like, I, if I can get down to, like, 40%, that'd be nice. Because 60% is better. By holding control, you can cage pro view, which highlights areas of grass that have not been cut. Ooh! I see. Did it always, it does always change. It always resets the camera. Okay, I don't like that. It should keep the camera view kind of where it is, but that's a little bit jarring. Minor complaint on that. Hopefully uh, the volume's not too bad on the, on the engine. Kind of messed up there looking at stuff. So the I and T is like all or nothing. I don't I don't see an in between there. All right, we're back at start. We see some of my mistakes here. So we're just gonna hit that, and then we're gonna just gonna start here. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. More mistakes. You don't see that over there on the right. Nope. Out of sight, out of mind. Wait, wait, wait. Did I miss? I didn't miss. Yeah, it's kind of cool that the engine sounds actually decrease when you zoom the camera out. That's nice. Oh, oh, oh dear. And again, guys, you can go download a demo of this right now on Steam. I'll put the link in the show description. Uh, as far as the Steam Next event, there's a demo, free demo. And uh, I don't know what the price is uh, for the full game. I'll try to find that out. And I'll put it in the uh, show notes as well. Ooh. Kind of losing my way here. But it did say it's supposed to release in summer 2021. So, great work in a real contract. You expect to cut all the grass. When the contract is completed, you have to drive your vehicle back to the trailer to end it. Alright, cool. So let's disengage the blade. 
Hit Q. Go back to the truck. Oh yeah, this is this is what I'm talking about. I'm enjoying this, even with all the little little early hiccups and stuff. At the end of the day, you're cutting grass. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, good stuff, good stuff. After completing the test drive, you can now purchase the vehicle, or you, or if you would like, you can test drive another vehicle. Okay, okay, like that. Um, that lose. Oh, confirm. I think I hit back too many times here. Company logo. We did that. Confirm. Confirm. Okay. Okay, I already did a test drive. Ah, so you test drive something, then you need to buy something too. So I think I'm just gonna buy the one that we just did. And I don't see where my money is. I assume I don't have any money. Like a whole lot of money, but hey, let's buy it. Give me. Select the contract. This is the contract map where you can see all available contracts. Select and start. Now that your company's set up, you have a more. Select the contract button at the bottom of the map to open and set it up. Okay. One contract. Once you select a contract, you can see information about its value and requirements. If you wish to accept the contract, you need to uh, first you need to sign an employee and a vehicle. Select either employee or vehicle option in the left next. Me. Vehicle. That. Good. So they want 99%, 5 to 6 centimeters. Recommended cut time 26 minutes. Confirm contract. As you set up a confirmed contracts, so their pin on the map will turn yellow, and the contract that you are assigned will have a star displayed. The first contract confirmed, you can start it to head to the location beginning cutting. There's a star. Start to do. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. With all that being said. <laughs> Okay, I didn't check the frame rate of the uh, video. Looks like it's choppy a little bit here. Hopefully it was smooth during the cut. But uh, during this loading phase, uh, it's a little bit choppy. I'll confirm. Okay, get on vehicle. Be sure you want to exit ground check. Remains. Yes, I am. Okay. Hold Z to start engine. Now my resolution is changed. You notice that. Huh. It it was full screen before and now it's not interesting. Let me try alt enter trick. Very interesting. Okay. I actually liked it how it was before. It was ultra wide, but now it's not. Firm. Okay, let's go down in there. And... Uh, T. <laughs> okay. 
So we'll get your performance during cutting will affect how much money and RP you earn. You need to find the balance between speed and careful driving, avoiding damage in the flowers or the lawn. Uh oh, you troubled out. Alright, Q Z You're cutting at the wrong height. I'm getting on it, dude. Uh E and C. There we go. Man, I'm going fast. I am going fast. This seems to be going faster than the other one. Oh boy. Cover your eyes. Yeah, another thing is that you can see the mouse cursor. And uh, yeah, the frame rate's kind of bad right now. See if this will help. Yeah, 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 I went to windowed mode there. It seems to be a little bit happier. Oh, I just cut some flowers. Whoa! Come back for you. So, I guess some questions I have is I, I wonder if you could do like weeding. Not weeding, but uh, edging. Edging tools and kind of stuff like that. Or you just limit it to mowers. That'd be interesting to see. Nice. At the end of the day, you cutting grass. Or what was that? I heard a stall. It was like, Meh. That was kind of weird. All right, so we're a little bit better on frame rate. I was hoping I could capture this at 3440 by 1440 because I have ultra wide. I play pretty much all my sims in ultra wide, but it doesn't seem to support that completely. It started out that way, but then as screens transitioned and I got the different parts, it reverted back to 2560 by 1440. I believe I'm saying the right numbers there. All right, why? Okay, my, my speedometer turned red there. And I'm not sure why. You really don't have tight control over like your speed. It's either all or nothing. Unless there's a cruise control. Yeah, see there's like there's like a red line, a red a red indicator there. And you, you don't want to go over that apparently. Maybe there's like hills where I accelerate a little bit too fast and I have to slow down. Because, yeah, I know there's such a thing as going too fast. So there's a hill around here somewhere where I, I think it's on uh, opposite of me now. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
Alright, I think it's coming up. Yeah. Little Bivik said, yeah, you saw that? There it is, that's the spot. Like a little bit of a hill there where you get some acceleration and you go too fast. Now I know. And knowing is half the G. Uh, <clears throat> okay. What a pleasant sound. Fifty two percent. I just changed views for a second. Oh, oh, that's how you mess up things. You just gotta change things around, don't you, Buana? Okay, I heard that sound again. I think that was another dip. Oh, it happened again. Let's get a little spot here. A little spot we missed. Wow, oh, this camera. I can't seem to move it like I want to. I think my cursor, hold on. There we go. I couldn't seem to do that for some reason. All right, back to window. Yeah, I heard a car. Nice ambient sounds. Sorry. I'm sorry. Don't get the flowers. <laughs> There's a little piece over there after yet, but it's fine. Yeah, I'm butchering both of these corners here. It's fine. It's just a video game. I'm being paid with dollar dues. It's not real money. Oh. That's cool. We're almost done, but almost 70%. I'm leaving streaks, but you know what? For the purposes of this video, it doesn't have to be perfect. Blasphemy, Buona. You call yourself a lawnsman? You call yourself a landscapesman? You call yourself a grass cutterman? <laughs> okay. Uh, there we go. Oh. I'm fighting the camera. That's, that's one thing. That's probably my biggest negative so far is that I'm, I'm kind of fighting the camera and get used to it. Which is probably why I'm probably going to default to this quite a bit. Because even in games like Farm Sim, I, I would only stick to certain cameras, camera views for so long. Yeah, this might be a case of hooking up a controller and see how it is with that. Cause I did, I did do farm sim with a controller, keyboard and mouse as well. But uh, I think I ended up the last time I played, I ended up settling on a controller setup. Do not cut the flower. Out. Eighty percent. Practically done, man. 
Easy job. Easy life. Yes, I'm controlling everything with Waz, W and S and D. Oh, I didn't see you over here. Alright, let's just knock this out. Do not cut the flower out. Sir, yes, sir! I think I might have hit him anyway. You damaged the ground, filing incurred. Yep, I did. <laughs> Can't take you nowhere. Everywhere you go, you damaging flowers. Boy, what's the matter, you, huh? Hey, I don't think I damaged those. Did I? I don't know. <laughs> Part of me wants to just damage all the flowers to see how much they can take before they just like kick me off the job. I probably have more fines than the uh than the actual cost. Should be kind of funny actually. What? Is that a bird? Sound like a bird. Okay, mm. how did that damage the ground? Did that spin too much? Okay, you can't do wheelies. Got it. Okay. Can't do wheelies. Noted. In log. Probably sharp turns are frowned upon. Whoops, I missed that. Don't worry. I come back for you, sir. One. Pass. Two. Pass. 2.5 damaging pass. With the cutting complete, you now need to drive back to the trailer and leave the location. If you have time left, you can clean up any grass clippings you may have left in the past to avoid cleanup fees. Uh, oh wow, so you don't have to do 100-100%. I mean, I can just leave this here like this. 
Yeah? I damaged the crowd again. You should have just left while you were hit. Return to trailer. You've got it. Haha. -ha. Look what I did. All right, so it's a little framey. A little framey in certain areas. Uh, doesn't support ultra wide completely. Uh, for the next coverage I do, I'm, I know what to do now. In terms of uh, resolution frame rate and all that kind of good stuff. I might have to kick the graphics down. But overall, that was pretty fun. That was what I expected. At the end of the day, you're cutting the grass. Okay. So I wonder if you can change the currency. You can change the... Oh, here we go. Length units. Let's go Imperial. I don't know if they have... Uh... Yeah. That's fine. I think next time I play, I'm gonna try with the uh, with the controller. Yeah, but overall, it doesn't support widescreen, ultra widescreen, and I wish it did. But I think that's something they can add. Oh, here's the volume. I didn't see the volume on the title screen. It is on. Okay, it's right here. So I think I will turn the menu music to like five. And the uh, blade down to like seven. The mower master, I'll turn to eight. Engine, I'll turn to seven. Sound effects to like eight. Oh, okay. This is sounding better already. Game effects, sound effects, ambient, like nine. Gameplay, like eight. Notification, that's fine. Speaker mode stereo. Okay. Didn't even know that was there. Skyhook Games! That must be a replay thing there. Oh no, these are arrows. <laughs> that must be a replay thing there. Yeah, so other thing, another thing is that I wish that the camera sensitivity can go a little bit lower, but I can always adjust my mouse DPI to, to get around that. A um, few more options would be nice. I think the camera was a little wonky, but I think that can be solved by going with keyboard. I mean, going to controller. Cool, man. This is Lawn Mowing Simulator. Let me show the credits here. By Skyhook Games. Thank you so much for, some, uh, for providing me a key to check this out. You guys can go download the demo right now on Steam on the Steam Next event. And uh, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, I, I apologize for some of the production quirks because the frame rate was low framing. But that's how we do here sometimes. You guys take care of yourself, and I'll see you next time. Make sure you join our Patreon if you enjoy the content. Thanks, patrons, for supporting me at patreon.com slash buona. Also, you can comment, like, subscribe to the video if you enjoyed it. That'd be nice. That'd be nice. Check out my live stream at twitch.tv slash buona. We stream there pretty much every day. Just a couple days off a week. And uh, also join my Instagram, instagram.com slash buona. I've been 3D printing stuff. You can, get, you can check out pictures, pictures of it there. Take care, you guys. Take care of yourself, guys. I'll see you later. Good night. Bye-bye.